Let me do an introduction and a warning. My name is the Leviathan Centipede, and the warning is I want to show you how to see your ass. I'm from fight better than ever, man. So, for the next 10 minutes, I'm going to give you 10 years experience. So, anyway, People could talk a lot of shit, man. But when you get punched in the head, man, how the fuck you gonna think, huh? Come on, man, put some lie to it. Well, let's begin. You got a 200 pound man with muscles and that could throw knuckles. And you're gonna contract on every side of your head bone. What you gonna do? The weak spot the chin out the on um, skull. Out the body, the weak spot is the midsection. This is what you're gonna do, man. You're gonna surrender a limb. And you're gonna have your right hand. Because the, when the power's dead, the power's dead. Uh -oh, yeah. He could be the strongest man on earth. But if you know a contraction, you know how to do a contraction and expansion. Let's do a contraction. You got one, two movements right there. That's four movements again. You uh, in, in your shadow boxing. The aggression, the protection. Ha, ha. How you avoid a punch in the head? As a boxer, I'm just watching his physicists getting close, so I move backwards. Anything to get a, to get your opponent in a punch in your head. The only way you could take an opponent's aggression is if it what? If you train the same like him or a little bit harder. Cause you just feeling them. So 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 you got your um you got your basic boxer movements, right? When you surrender then. And you got the two contractions. The two contractions, and then you move the head around. Cause if you make a miss your head, and guess what? Maybe he's a little bit stronger than you. As soon as connection come to the fist to the head, the, the body gonna know if it got enough or not. If the dude is stronger than you think, then guess what? The central nervous system, you got a spine right here, connected to the hips, to the rib cage, and to the skull. The spine is gonna, the central nervous system going on straight to the head, the legs are gonna go whoops, no matter how many marathons you run. Almost finished, man. So what, what, what? You gonna knuckle up on the dude, say yo, Hit him a couple of shots. Oh, oh, that I forgot. So you want to kick too, huh? The knees go up. You got to do this in your shadow boxing. Because guess what? When, when you get hit in the head, you can't think. Those are automatic movements. I'm showing my body naturally to come back with the aggression. Two hundred pounds, five nine. So anyway, huh? How we toughen up the knuckles? Push-ups on the knuckles. 
forearms. You gotta lift some weights on the backhand. This gotta be thick. I don't need no bicep. That's basically a pulling tool in my ladder, boys. I don't, I don't, the ladder, I don't need that either. So anyway, the knees goes up, just in case you get close to them, and then in your, in your sparring, the, the hand touches the knee. You know why? You, you, you're showing an automatic movement, because when your hand goes in back of that opponent's head, and you hit him in his, I think, I think that's all she wrote right there. As a boxer, it, you always the jab has to be stronger than your right hand. Cause why? You're gonna show do the lesson. Cause you're stronger than him. And then the, the knees go up too. You could do like, like, like 10 reps. Like five and five right there. You showing the brain how to do an automatic movement under terror. Oh, oh, that huffing and puffing too, man. You want to fight for hours, not for minutes. You hold your breath in. No matter how terrorizing they look in the eye, don't agitate the heart and the lungs. You are your own worst enemy. So um, so pretty soon you, you want to kick. So the knees go up. Pretty soon then the heels go out. And, and you catch a good contact on the kick sooner or later. Two, two, two basic movements. Bam! There's no wooden dummy. That's four movements you show in your head automatically. So let's say you lose this arm and you see terror coming from this side. You're not, it's so fast, the terror going in your eyes, the brain ain't even gonna think, man, it's gonna sacrifice the limb before 